Eric LaRoche and Suzanne Parker are enjoying a quiet evening in their Gilmington home, a day after the two found themselves in a scary situation. On Saturday, they were snowmobiling in Randolph and were turning back after finishing a nice picnic. Chili was on the menu. We went up around this little thing and we were like going five miles an hour. And we tipped over and I fell. Suzanne seriously injured her shoulder. Eric ran over to help. He says his old Boy Scouts training kicked in. Got her stabilized, put hand warmers all over, covered it with my jacket. Once Eric performed first aid on Suzanne, he then grabbed his phone to call for help. The only issue, there was no service, so his phone was useless. He had to make the decision to leave Suzanne behind and go look for help. Eric describes it as the longest 10 miles of his life. The same could be said for Suzanne. At first I was freaking out a little bit, but then I tried to do a little yoga breathing and calm myself down and think happy thoughts and, yeah. you know, said some prayers. Eventually, Eric came across a house and was able to dial 911. I headed back, you know, to get yeah. her. Uh, I knew, you know, I knew, you know, it had been a little while. I knew she was probably freaking out. I really needed to get back there. And then he came back, which was music to my ears. I yeah. heard that machine coming back up the hill, and I'm like, thank God. First responders and passersby all pitched in to help, an effort both Suzanne and Eric say they are forever thankful for. Thank you to Whitefield, Randolph, Lancaster. Uh, Jefferson. Jefferson. Fish and Game, uh, fish and the game. state police, everybody. You're it amazing. Was... You're my hero. In Gilmanton, I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.